we sent the dry hay first, it was weighing around between 1250 and 1260 a bale. And when we got back to the steamer hay, it was weighing between 1380 and 1420. Bale weight's up. Our test is up a little. We've done a little bit, you know, going with just do or just steaming. We're about a 20 point difference on relative feed value. The buyer was there from, he was going along and he was probing every bale. And every time he'd stick that probe in, it was coming out at 14.7, 14.7. And he, he kept looking at his probe like something was wrong with it. And uh, he says, How, what's up with this? I says, well, that's, we try and run just shy of 15%. The being able to, every bale he was probing was the same through the, through the stack. The consistency was just amazing. Being able to get out before the storms come, being able to go longer hours, uh, we were definitely able to um, stay ahead of the game. And we couldn't believe our eyes what was coming out of the back of the what was coming out of the back of that hay baler. It makes a sellable product. It just makes something buyers like and they can use. So we were only getting you know, four to six hours of dew a night um, until we'd get dewed out. Uh, and so with the steamer, right now we'll bail, you know, 15 hours a day. I can put up 500 acres of hay in one day with one machine. It is super simple to operate. The screen is great. Uh, everything's easy, easy to operate. It's so perfect for this operation, you know, really. I just, it, we wouldn't, I don't think we could really make decent hay without it. It sure makes it easier to sell the hay. And on a year like this, that means something because there's a lot of guys that haven't sold any hay. It's adding a couple hundred pounds, which is just, more money in our customers' pockets, which we're happy with. I mean, it just opens up so many windows that we didn't think were really possible. You know, nothing really compares to, to your first time in a steamer. Some of the bells were weighing 1,600 pounds, uh, and the ends of them, all you could see was leaves. It's, a, it's just kind of a dream come true to think that you could actually produce dew when you need it. It's easy to see that steamer hay and, and the difference between them. There haven't been too many advancements in technology when it comes to baling hay. Um, and so I think this changes the way everything's done.